Denne video blev lavet før både Peterlin blev rigere og rum som en eskimo bjørne her. brought with me only the absolute essential to take these pictures and uh, first is of course my partner in crime Mikey This is not working. A drastic measures has to be taken. Which means selecting the gear that I want to take and just leave the sleds behind. So we need a tripod. We need Mikey. We need Mikey. Yeah, you go with us. You go with us. Yeah. We need DSLR. We need a radio controller. I didn't brought my microphone, or actually I did, but I brought this one. Zoom H1. Extra battery. Dry cloth. Drone. It's not Mavic Pro. You are absolutely right. Extra socks, dry socks, that's always good. One apple, second tea. T-shirt, absolutely, and matches. Fire is good. Yeah, this is um, Hasselblad X-Pan. Two rolls of film. Tehrama will stay here. It's okay. Okay, I think that's all I need. All this will go. Will go. Oh. Okay, let's go. Check this bear, he was really big, or he is really big. Look, look at my foot, he has a bigger claw than my foot. Look at that, that's amazing. Look at that, wow, that was a big guy, that was a big guy. Whoa. Sorry, sorry again. My tripod is really old. Ah. <laughs> That's great. Oh, fantastic. I just want to say that uh, while you're walking in forest and you see and uh, there is an area with bear, you just have to make some noise like uh like vlogging vlogging is perfect because you know bear will retrieve and but you can also sing i know one more song on this theme forest and it's it's very cheerful it always cheers me up 
and I hopefully it will cheer you up too. It goes like this. I'm a lumberjack and I'm okay. I sleep all night and work all day. He's a lumberjack and he's okay. He sleeps all night and works all day. I cut down trees, I eat my lunch, I go to the lava tree. Oh, Wednesdays I go shopping. Something, something, da, da, da. He's a lumberjack and he's okay. He sleeps all night and works all day. I wear high heels. Something, something, song. Suspenser and a bra. I like to be a girly, just like my dear papa. I cut down trees, I wear high heels, suspend in the land of stars. I wish I'd been a girly, just like my dear papa. Oh, hear that just like uh, very gentle sounds of birds and nature and nothing else this is why I love this woodland so much it's just so amazing so silent but so present you know behind me there is a hospital um, in the middle of woodland this was uh, during the Second World War, it was like uh, one of the 27 hospitals all around the woodland. This woodland was the heart of the resistance during the Second World War. And uh, <laughs> very interesting enough, this hospital didn't have a single, maybe it had like a single soldier to actually guard, but didn't have any guard. There was like only medical sisters and, um, and doctors and patients. Uh, the only security they had was conspiracy basically they were hidden so well nobody ever found them uh, not even commanders like a political commanders um, of partisans uh, they didn't knew where this is uh, Maček for instance people in Slovenia knows this name uh, didn't knew where this hospital is that's how uh, secret that was you know only people that had to know knew where it is anyway I'm here uh, to do a film test. <laughs> I brought this uh, X-Pan with me, Hasselblad X-Pan, and I will shoot uh, two rolls of film. 
then I will cut it and then I will compare it uh, with um, what um, the film developer ID11, Pyrocat and Rodinal and then we will print them and let's see which one is better. That's a food uh, from a deer. This food was a meal from, from a bear or from a wolf uh, last week or yeah, something like that. Because I can smell it already and it's winter. So, but you know, it's not under the snow. So, and you know, you can see the flesh still there. Well, it's nature. So bon appetit and rest in peace. Okay, um, you know, I hope you enjoy my singing, you know, and I hope you will subscribe to my channel because of my singing capabilities. I wish people would appreciate me as a photographer, don't they? Anyway, I'm finishing this vlog for one very important reason. I forgot to mention one book. I had the book, but because it was, it was left in a Land Rover. I wanted to talk about that book, but I forgot, you know, to record. Anyway. Lindsay Rogers was a surgeon from New Zealand and during the Second World War he wanted to be a uh, he wanted to fight in a guerrilla conditions so he was sent to Yugoslavia. He had a hospital just like we have seen in Yellendol. He, his hospital was uh, on the area of uh, Virgin Forest Pechke. Only a dozen people know where that is. You cannot see anything there, you know, maybe some rock formations. In the best case, we have found uh, a few years ago a uh, remaining of one uh, rusty pot. Anyway, Lin Lindsay Rogers was a surgeon from New Zealand who was operating uh, during the Second World War in the Kuchewski Rock. And, and he also wrote a book. Uh, this book was translated to Serbo-Croatian in the uh, in 60s, but was censored. And uh, last year, his book uh, was retranslated, a uh, new edition in Slovenian. And it's uh, and also the censored part are marked. I don't know why they censor it actually, but you know they were very sensitive times then. Anyway, um, I really re recommend to read it. Uh, it's a really good book, especially because it was it's happening right there. And the second reason why we are finishing here in Atelier is because I hate talking head format of vlog. I you know I could go just there by the river Kirka and just shoot those two rolls of film but you know I wanted to have I want to enjoy myself too you know and that's why we went there and that's why this vlog will be again much longer than usual but that's how it is that's how life is uh, my plan is uh, in next vlog to develop this rolls uh, with three developers with three film developers Pyrocat, HD, um, Rodinal and uh, Kodak D76 or Ilford I also known as Ilford ID11 and then make prints and see what's the difference That's it subscribe press like share the information But but let's do not forget
<laughs> one more thing. Uh, thank you for buying my books. I sold uh, in the last few weeks, I've sold six books uh, to United States, UK, France and uh, Japan. So thank you very much. It means a lot to me. Although I must admit I have only 50 books left, so it will be sold out any minute. So buy it now. <laughs>